Good morning and greetings from another principal podcast. Today is Wednesday, October 24th. We would like to express appreciation to our PTA and to Jane Tilby for their great work for a, a wonderful week on Red Ribbon Week and various activities that are reminding our students to make good and wise and healthy choices. We also want to express appreciation for your support during our cookie dough fundraiser, which concluded last week. We're still tallying everything, and we'll let you know soon how that came out. Upcoming activities on Tuesday, October 30th, our fifth grade will be attending BizTown, sponsored by Junior Achievement. This is a great experience for our fifth graders as they get for a day to run an actual town. From someone being mayor to bankers to different business people and uh, see how a town works. It's a great opportunity. On Wednesday, October 31st will be our Halloween parade. That will start at 9.30 for grades K through 6. Students are to wear their costumes to school and then after the parade, grades 1 through 6, will change back into the regular school clothes for the rest of the day. Our afternoon kindergarten parade will begin at 1.30 and again kindergarten students wear their costumes to school and will wear them all day. Just a reminder that costumes should be free of any type of a weapon or a facsimile of a weapon and that we ask there be no masks and that would include a partial face mask like a ninja mask. On Thursday, November 1st, will be an early out day. The Board of Education has enacted that day as uh, some time for teachers in preparation for parent conferences. Friday, November 2nd, will also be an early out day. Our parent-teacher conferences are scheduled for November 7th and 8th. You should have received information to schedule your conference time by going to our school website and clicking on the online scheduler icon to schedule your parent conference. If you need help with that, please call the office. And we do have a computer here in the office that parents can come in and use to schedule that conference if they do not have access to a computer at home. The window for that online scheduler will close on October 31st at midnight. Thank you again for your support. Great things continue to happen at Sprucewood. Remember, we're working to be safe, respectful, and responsible. Thank you and have a good day.